here's the deal, Uncle Charlie. I find you attractive. I have three kids, a bastard of an ex-husband. I work 50 hours a week running my own travel agency. I'm at the peak of my sexuality, and I have a three-hour window Wednesday nights when the kids are at Taekwondo. <laughs> you in or out? I'm sorry. I, I'm terminally hungover, and I just took a cleat in the groin. Email me. All aboard Gloria at AOL.com. So which one's yours? Oh, please don't make me talk. This is Charlie Harper, Alan Harper's brother. So who's winning? No one. Now, we don't keep score. We think it's healthier if the kids just play for fun. You're yanking me, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Judith warned us that you were a pistol. <laughs> By the way, we were so sorry to hear about her and Alan. So tell us, is it true? Did Judith leave your brother for another woman? Why don't you ask Judith? We wouldn't want to pry. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies, if you'll excuse me, I have to go, because... Oh, hell, I don't need a reason. Someone's a little full of himself? Forget him. His brother's the one who's in play. How's Jake doing? Jake's fine. He's ten. He's got his whole life ahead of him. Me, on the other hand, I'm sitting in the hot sun in rented pants listening to myself blink. I'll ask somebody else. <laughs> what? Sorry, I couldn't help overhearing, and you just look so... pathetic. Really? The guy at the tuck shop said I look dashing. Of course, that was yesterday, and I found his phone number in my pocket. What was the occasion? Just returning a video. Charlie Harper. Kate McLaughlin. Let me ask you something, Kate McLaughlin. Hmm. What's your take on this whole note-keeping score thing? Oh, I think it's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Can I stay here next to you where it's safe? Sure. So which one's yours? Uh, number nine. But I'm not the father. Well, aren't you a good sport? Jake, for the last time, nobody got creamed. No one won, no one lost. Yeah, except for us, 12 to 2. Well, it doesn't matter if you win or lose. It's whether or not you beat the spread. Thank you, Charlie. Jake, go take a shower. Charlie, we are trying to teach the kids not to keep score. Well, you should have thought of that before you taught them to count. <laughs> By the way, uh, what are you doing with Jake tomorrow? I don't know why. I made a play date for him with one of the kids from the game. You're hitting on the mother, aren't you? Can't slip one past you, can I? That's not what a play date is for. What? The kid plays, I have a date, everybody wins. Everybody wins? Yes. But I promise not to keep score. Charlie, you cannot use my son to pick up single mothers. Ah, but I can. <laughs> Good night, snack buddy. No going in the water, no throwing rocks, and remember, if you can't see us, we can't see you. Is there anything you'd like to add, Charlie? Why can't they throw rocks? Go. <laughs> Ernie loves the beach. Thanks for inviting him. Hey, anything for the kids. They're our future. So where's Alan? I sent him to the movies. He deserves a break now and then, and I get some quality uncle time with Jake. I think that is really nice of you. Ernie, keep your socks with your shoes. I'm sorry, where was I? You were saying I was nice about something? So how long have you lived in Sherman Oaks? Gosh, we moved in, and Ernie, put that down, it's dead! I swear that kid will pick up anything, no matter what it looks like. Been there. <laughs> anyway, uh, we moved in just in time for the earthquake, and Ernie, I am not gonna say it again. Put the dead thing down. Jake, you should probably put your dead thing down, too. <laughs> Kids, huh? I know, they're just... Ernie, put it down and we're leaving right now. I'm counting to three. One, two. Ernie, for God's sake, you're killing me here. <laughs> Thank you. No problem. So did you grow up in LA? No, my dad was in the army, so we moved around. Oh, hell, that thing's not dead. 
Charlie, I would really like to get to know you, but it is not going to happen on a play date. Why don't you ask me out sometime? You know, that's a really good... Are you good... happy? <laughs> I told you to put it down, Ernie. Get the sand off of it. Don't, don't, don't touch it. Don't touch so what it. What night's good for you? Jake, you're not helping. <laughs> Men, 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 men